was very pleased when I got the letter from Professor Christopher Bones, the chair of the ISAC International Supervisory Group, where he, in his letter, he uh, informed me that I had been approved by the Global Organization for the ISAC Global Alumni Hall of Fame. I feel very honored for this. And I'm, I'm delighted because it has given me an opportunity to uh, think of the, uh, go, go back in my, my life for a long, long time, actually over 40 years, and, and recall the positive experiences I got with my friends from the time we were involved in, in as students in the ISEC activities. And when I think of those uh, months and years, I realize how much concrete help ISEC could offer actually us. Not every one of us had the, had the opportunity to, to stay abroad. I had been for three years uh, before I started studying again. So, so I was in a, in, a, in a better position than most. But I remember going to meet the heads of the Finnish companies uh, in order to convince them that we should receive foreign students to Finland and, and then also trying to place our countrymen and, and countrywomen into different countries in the, in the world. And I, realizing then later on how positive impact these training months had had in their future careers. Uh, I'm involved in many organizations, but not every organization that I'm involved can, can contribute so concretely as Isaac has done because we can see in the individual development of the persons who have benefited from these training opportunities, how much they have learned and how it has made them more capable of, of continuing their studies, because life is a, a, a continuing educational exercise. Uh, I don't think any of us, and I'm now 72, I, I still feel that every day one is learning something new and, and that desire is extremely important in the more and more complex world where we live. Therefore, I would like to encourage today's students to utilize the possibilities that they have and they should also work hard to, to facilitate these programs. And I hope that the companies and organizations that were already active 40, 50 years ago, that they also would be as forthcoming as they have been over the years in all countries where ISEC operates, so that we can give a possibility for as many students as possible to gain this useful experience that will benefit their life. It's the individual's life, and I, I think when we live in a globalized world, I think we are much better to, to work and contribute in that sort of atmosphere if we have had that concrete work experience. Without that, life is much more complicated, and the earlier you get this experience, the better. Because uh, those of us who have had to do it much later realize that, that how beneficial it has been for those who would do it in their younger years. So I wish you all a successful event in Malaysia. I'm sorry that I can't be there with you. I agreed already a year ago that I would be speaking in, in, in Austria in an event that takes place at the same time when you are meeting there. I have been to Malaysia and I would have loved to revisit Malaysia but this time is, is unfortunately not possible. But my profound thanks for, for the honor you have bestowed on me. Thank you.